Do you have a rigid personality? Well, maybe you have a rigid training. According to Sigmund Freud, body training contributes to one's psychosexual development. We talk about five stages of psychosexual development. On the second stage, which is from 18 to 3 years of age, he called the stage anal stage. Freud thinks that at this age, it's all about the erogenous focus of anal stage. He emphasized the child's control over defecating as the pleasure center. Freud sees the major conflict issue during this stage is the way how parents totally train their children. A fixation at this age group can result in a personality that is too rigid or too disordered in the future. Freud thought that improper potty training could traumatize a child and cause him, him or her to become an anal retentive. Anal retentive personality can be stingy, rigid, controlling, with a compulsive order and tidiness. The person is generally stubborn, perfectionist, obstinate, and obsessed with neatness. You've learned control and reaction to your toilet training experience. In the other hand, anal explosive personality is an opposite of anal retentive personality. In Freud's view, this person is messy, sloppy, careless, lack of self-control, thus indicates an expulsive rebellion against parental control. Now let's put this potty train together. This was a gift to my son for his first birthday. Hold the right side of the chair upright, then insert the seat with the holes in the middle of the right side of the chair. Now grab the left side of the chair and insert the protruding threads on those two holes on the middle. Find your backrest and insert those two opposing threads to each side of the armrest. Press all parts together. Give it a tap if you need to. And now you can secure the three threads using the plastic bolts. Do the same thing on the other side. After that, you may need to find your blue lid cover. You may need to twist it to force it in. It has a supplied two screws to secure the tissue holder. The armchair is pretty whole, so it's easy to screw them in. So this orange thing, they call it a shield, but I don't know the purpose of this shield, since you have a lid cover. Now this white thing is for the music, it has only one sound. Just press it in. It has only one music and the sound is a bit cheap and a bit annoying.
like maybe your child will get entertained while using your chair. Now it's time for our sticker to stick them. Let's try to differentiate which is for the left and which is for the right. I think this character on the side is a cow and for the back seat the character is giraffe. Just eyeball it, just make sure you are on the center because it's difficult to remove them if you commit mistake. Freud suggested that parents manage toilet training with praise and reward. He believed promoting positive reinforcement after using toilet at the appropriate times fostered positive outcomes. The parents help make the outcome of this stage a positive experience which will lead to a creative, productive, and competent adult. Again guys, thank you much for watching. Please like and subscribe. Hit the thumbs up button. See you guys later. Have a good one.